it's race day. Everybody's feeling the vibe right now. We got uh, Scott coming in here and uh, doing driver change practice right at the end. We want to make sure that's really right. Car feels really good. And um, yeah, everyone's looking forward to the day. It's a, it's a beautiful sunny day. It's going to be a huge crowd. It's going to be uh, an awesome event. We just got out of the car, it was a pretty nasty accident there, so it was a big yellow. Uh, we decided to come in, change driver and tyres. But we were running P3 at the time, which is really good. We're hanging in there. Uh, there's a couple of the guys in front a little bit quicker than us, but not too much. Um, and also with the tyres, the more running we do, the better and better the car gets. So these sort of yellows that are coming out are probably hurting us. But later on, if we clear up some of those yellows, we'll be in a much uh, stronger state. That was uh, an absolute blast, you know, kind of dicing for the lead the whole way. Uh, but I, you know, I got into the car right when the sun was coming down and I had to wear a clear visor because I knew I was going to be going into the dark. Down in here at Sebring, the sun really goes really low on the back straight, makes it really difficult to see where you're turning into turn 17. Uh, and then we, it's a real changeover from then to dark. And it's a dark I quite like and the car was really hooked up and we were able to get through to the lead. And then on the on the restart after the pit stops, the, the Ford just got too much power, just blew past me. I just waited, trying to make sure I had a chance and when I got it, I got past him, then he got past me and then I got past him again. And uh, now we're 16 seconds in the lead uh, with about an hour and 25 minutes to go. So we're in good shape, but there's a long way to go, but we'll keep pushing. they put on today from Extreme Speed Motorsports at the Gila Patron, the number one, the drivers, Scott Sharp, Ryan Dial, and David Bramham. Well, here we are. It's now the end of the uh, 12 hours here at Sebring. And I have to say, we're, uh, we're pleased to finish second, but we're gutted at the same time because uh, we really thought we had the chance to win and we were running up front. We just caught out in the yellow right at the end and that just put us right behind. So it was unfortunate, but it was a fantastic team effort. Congratulations to the winners. I'm a very good friend of Marino Franchitti and I'm really pleased for him as well. So um, second place, I guess we can't complain. It's a fantastic team effort, like I said. I think we finished second and fifth. And it's uh, great, uh, great points for, for, the, for the guys here. So they move on to Long Beach and uh, let's hope that they uh, pull a win off there.